Ash, how are we? hours away now, just weighed in. Yep. How are you feeling? Yeah, very good, man, very good. Class camp that this was. Uh, change of opponent last minute, that's thrown a spanner in the works a bit. I was hoping to punch a yank in the face, but no, apparently got a guy stepping up last minute, so either way, he's still going in there for the same job, you know? Yeah. See, it's your second venture into BKB. What, have you, what did you learn from the from your first fight? Uh, <laughs> to be honest, last time it was such... I, I, the stars aligned, you know what I mean? Like That, that was my one-in-a-million moment, you know? It was... Uh, it was a great shot, oh, yes. I've seen it and things Can like that, but Tony now Vian this one feels Tom a bit different Wilson. as in now I, I, I get to dig into the trenches a bit. I don't see me getting this guy out there super early, but I can still see, I think he's going to go into the second round, but this guy, you know, hopefully I'll find his off button in the second. And, you know, he just comes with his own risk, being a bigger guy and being heavier and things like that. But as long as I'm smart, I have no doubt that it's going to be the same result. Yeah, let's talk about Jack. You know, a last minute opponent, experienced, experienced BKB game. fighter. Don't He's also got a, like a bit of a weird style as well. You know, have you done much prep for that? I mean, not a lot of time to Wait, prep for it. But how's that been? Not, not massively. Again, how do you prep for someone in three, four days? Do you know what I mean? But they, they rang me. They said who, who, who it was. And to be honest, what, oh, whatever gets game. me higher up the rankings, totally you know, like I, I proved I can hang with, you know. I can make a bit of a statement and I, I'm going to use this guy again to see if I can do the same. Like, he's got my own respect. He's stepping in last minute and he's a warrior. I've seen him fight, but, you know, my, my goal is still ultimately the same. I want to get past this guy and then hopefully then look for something shiny then soon. Yeah. What's that development been like from your first fight to this fight? What have you been working on? Footwork mainly. My biggest problem is I love a war. I obviously I know I didn't get a, really a chance to show that in the last one, but my biggest issue is that as soon as I get it, I prefer to stand in there and say, say, let's bring it on. But for this, it's kind of more just, it's got to be in and out. It's got to be footwork. It's got to be key. And I need to kind of show that, you know, it doesn't matter who I fight that. I've got oh, oh, the match game. the best in the world. I I mean, Simon what kind of fans expect to see from you tonight? Well, it's going to be, you know, I'm entertained in anyway. That's that's for sure. Um, it's going to be a quick start. It's going to either, I got a funny feeling he's going to run at me like a bull in a china shop. So it's fine if he does, let's, let's go. But I just got to weather a storm and then I'm going to start teeing off. And so we'll see what happens. But um, as I said, he's got my respect. I, you know, I'm sure I probably got his as well. But, but uh, whatever happens, we the same, same result, you know. What's the process like from now then? Is it, I suppose, eating first and then, you know, kind of, is there a visualisation? Do you kind of zone in or are you kind of quite relaxed? No, no, i got to be honest, I, I'm actually underweight. I am I could eat whatever I wanted right now. Um, it was nice when they said, oh yeah, 68 kilos. That's me walking around normally. But to be honest with this, it's more so, I, I just, just mentally being prepped. I'll put some music on now and I'll just dance around for a while and just chill, you know, I, I don't... There's no point in walking around and growling at things. And being pissed off. I'm just, I'm just going to be calm, relaxed, ready. I'm the first fight out. I get to do it early. Let's and then, as uh, well, as soon as, I, as soon as I'm done, then I can just relax and just enjoy the night again then, you know? So, yeah, that's the plan anyway. Yeah. What are the long-term plans for BKB? Do you want, uh, are you aiming for titles? Are you aiming for those matches? Yeah, 100%. I, I, <clears throat> when I found out that Chapman's opponent pulled out, I, I'll, I'll step up oh, by anyone. And that, you know, that's no joke. I, I, as long as the weight's right, they'll fight anyone. But obviously, uh, the idea is to go up a rank. So seeing the boys rack up, you know, being able to fight for British after two really good wins or three wins, you know what I mean? Like I just want to, I, I just want to fight for something shiny. You know, you got someone like Johnny Jones, who's, who, you know, I definitely don't want to fight him. As in, he's a good friend. You know what I mean? But. Right. Bump him up to the will his world title, which he deserves, and then give me uh, let me have a crack at a British if I put on a show, you know what I mean? So that's the that's the plan anyway. And if not, it doesn't really matter. I enjoy fighting, so even if they just leave me fighting people, I don't I don't really care. I like the oh, challenge, the I like whoever whoever's in front of me, I'm happy to have a go, you know? So well, full focus on Jack for BKB 34. Absolutely. Yeah, best of luck to you, Ash. Thank Can't you very much. Weighing in at 76.9.